An Alberta family has an incredible rescue story to tell, and they captured it all on video. It all began when an elk wandered onto some ice on a northwestern Alberta farm. Carmen Leibel has the exclusive story in tonight's News Extra. This morning there was a, a elk lying on our deck out. Poor little stick. On a cool morning, there was a strange sight on a farm near High Prairie in northwestern Alberta, an elk floundering on the ice of a dugout. Enter the Benoits, who had the unusual task of staging a rescue. You know what? I think that elk had spent the whole night there. I really do. The wild animal was exhausted, but repeatedly tried desperately to stand on all fours without success. It's just hard to watch, a eh? poor thing. Its chin would actually hit the ice at times and its legs would spread and it, it's just painful to watch. I love animals, I don't want it to get hurt. Gay Benoit's little girl Sienna was watching the drama unfold while shooting the video. It was stuck there. <laughs> stuck and not going anywhere, so Gabe got creative. So now we're putting sand for traction and hoping it'll make it off our dugout. The sand helped, but only for a matter of seconds. <laughs> Poor thing. Well, just like Bambi. <laughs> what was the next plan of attack? Well, then we just thought, well, actually, we thought, we let's try it, let's try and push it off. <laughs> Gabe was surprised by how calm the exhausted animal was, but he still had no luck. So. He pulled out his little tractor and used the blade to gently push the elk towards the snowbank. One hour after he had first started the rescue, Gabe thought he had finally found success. So I went to say, like, you know, see you later sort of thing. <laughs> That's when it kind of actually charged me and, <laughs> and it tripped over the blade and there it was on the dugout again. <laughs> Despite a lack of gratitude, Gabe hopped back on his tractor and tried again. This time, the elk staggered up on its legs and after pausing for a few seconds, turned to leave. The Benoits turned back to go home with some amazing video of an unbelievable rescue. They will never forget the day they saved the elk, who they think should be named Lucky. Carmen Leibel, CTV News, Edmonton. That had it? everything. Had your heart going, your hopes <laughs> going. And it was remarkable, you know, after that elk went through all of that, that he was able to stand up and just walk away. He did pause at the end. I think that was sort of a gentle thank you. <laughs> that was just a guess. Thank goodness there was a happy ending there. We're back in a moment.